coming to you with another Dollar Tree haul. Um, I just, I try not to go and I try, I try for like a couple of weeks not to go and then I just can't help myself. I end up just going crazy. So this is going to be a massive haul. So I'll try to make this as quick as possible. So starting with the cleaning items, this is, uh, this is the things that I got. I got uh, another one of these uh, Lysol toilet bowl cleaner things. Um, I really like these. Um, so I just try, they have a couple of different scents. So I've just been picking up a different scent every time I go. So this one is the country scent. Yes, country scent. And I also picked up some Lysol clean and fresh multi-surface cleaner and uh, it's just these are kind of like small containers but I just wanted to um, try these out I normally don't buy like name brand cleaning products so when I, this is a way for me to kind of try those and this one you can this makes up to five gallons so um, I bought I just happened to go ahead and buy a spray bottle for it so I can mix some up and that way I can have it diluted and um, because this is concentrated so that you can just make a batch of it. Uh, okay, oh, I also got this refreshing uh, uh, fabric and air freshener. This is, oh, I'm sorry, this is refreshing waterfall. It's the scent. And, oops, sorry. And uh, this is kind of like a Febreze type product. So I always, when I don't want to iron, I will throw my shirts or something back in the dryer. You have to wet them in order to get the wrinkles out. So it's good if you can just have something like this around that you can just spray it down. And that wets it, put it in the dryer, it also freshens it up and makes it smell nice. And that's why I got that. And then I also got this two-in-one quick eraser. It's kind of like the Mr. Clean Eraser. And they're very, they're very good for like your refrigerator and your stove and things like that. So that's the reason why I got this. You can also use this on your walls, it says. So like if your kids or something right on the walls, then um, you can use this. So I got, um, I always like to pick those up because you can never not need those. <laughs> and then I picked some of these up. This is supposed to go to work. Just like little sandwich bags, glad. I like to, and whenever time I find name brand stuff, I always like to try to pick those up but I do like the uh, no-name brand stuff too so I picked up two of these uh, fabric softeners that you put in the dryer like dryer sheets this one is fresh linen which I, that's one of my favorite scents is fresh linen and then this one smelled so good too that I had to grab it it's called oops, it's called Sun Sky Fresh there you go so these smell, oh, these smell so good, I just couldn't resist them. For a dollar, you just pick them up. Then I found these microwave cooking covers. So, um, I thought these would be easy. Oh, Ooh. and I picked up some of these, uh, this Lysol Click Gel. I've always seen the commercials for these, but I've never picked them up. So, I thought I would just try it and see if I liked it. And then these are screen and tech wipes. And I don't know why it has a car on there, but it says screen and tech wipes. And you can use these for your iPhone, um, your iPad, or your phone. I don't have an iPhone, but just any kind of technical device or uh, your, to clean your computer screen or whatever, you can just clean those. And then I bought this. A fresh, it's fresh linen. I love fresh linen. But um, it's like a air freshener that you put in those little holders that you plug in. It kind of heats it up and then it diffuses in the room. And I have one from Bath & Body. I thought maybe I would try it and see if it fit in there. Um, I'll let you know if it did or not. But um, I think it should. It looks kind of like the same size. So, And then I bought another one of these fans. I bought this one in pink. Because the other one I took to work, um, and although the battery doesn't last very long in it, um, I don't get hot that much at work. Just whenever I do, I can just turn it on for a few minutes and cool off. But this I bought to have at my nail station, so when I'm trying to like dry my nails, I can just put them right here in front of this fan and get them and get them to dry a little bit quicker. 
And the next thing I bought was this, these gripper pads. And they're just kind of round and you can put these on jars and things and open them um, super easy. Now on to the, these are, or school supplies maybe. These are pencil sharpeners. These are so cute. They're in the shape of a piranha. And then as uh, you sharpen your pencils, it falls off in here. And then there's a little, a little latch that you can undo to empty it out. But I thought these were so cute. I, I, I have to use pencils. I can't use mechanical pencils. I have to use real pencils. So this is great for using those. Keep them sharp. Of course, I always buy gum when I'm there. And I bought these. I'm not quite sure what they are, what they do. It says they're brush pens. And it looks like they're actually in a... I'm going to open these up because I have no idea what these are. Let's see what it is. So this is what it looks like. And... Oh, it's just like a felt tip pen. Okay. I don't know if that was a brush or what that was. But it's just like a... Kind of like a felt tip pen. But um, you could probably use these with kind of like you do alcohol inks, just put some, draw and then put some alcohol on it and use it for nail art, probably use it for drawing, um, you'll probably use this for a lot of things. So this came with uh, the primary colors, blue, green, yellow, and red. See, you can make any colors from that. And then I wanted to get, I like these little, um, they're, it says the file, Holder, but they're like for coupons so you can keep your coupons in these and they just have a couple of slots here that you can put coupons in and I I never noticed this before I don't think the ones that I've gotten before had this but they have like little labels that you can attach here to the uh, to the little round part there um, they have those so you can just stick on there and label them I also use these for some of my nail plates that I they don't have a case and I don't have a case for them and I want to keep up with them. They're kind of odd shapes. I'll follow them in here as well. So I just like to pick those up. And, and then the last couple of artsy things I got. I got this notebook. I'm going to take it to work. I love these little um, no, uh, non-lined notebooks or notebooks that don't have lines on them um, to kind of use as my swatching for my nail, uh, uh, my nail, uh, nail polish and stamping and stuff like that. This one's kind of small. Uh, I'm gonna take this one to work though, because I always buy go to go on lunch break and buy polish, and then I always want to swatch it. So I think this will be good to have at work to swatch with, as opposed to the big ones that I have here at the house that I swat that I swatch with. Okay, and then I bought some thank you cards, and I just thought they were super cute. Just kind of plain, but just super cute. I love the green. It's my favorite. This color green is my favorite color. So anytime I see something green like that, I always pick it up. And then um, this is a mini stereo speaker. I think I saw this on um, 3140 Baby, one of her uh, Dollar Tree hauls. Um, she, I thought this was so cute. I didn't know if it worked very well, but I wanted to just try it. They had lots of cute little different designs. And so I've been looking for these and I finally found them. So I'm going to try those. I'll have to let you know how they work. And now moving on to personal items. I feel like there's some there's stuff missing. Uh, oh, yeah. we got some other stuff got to do over there. We're only halfway through, people. Okay. This here is a shower cap. And they just had a lot of different designs and I always like to pick those up those are cute and then they I love 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 their socks I love these little crew type socks that they have these work really really well and they're just a dollar I've gotten some from uh, Marshalls or Ross and things like that and I don't like them uh, even five below they have cute designs but they just they don't fit my foot very well I don't know why but these always fit really really well they have really cute designs and they last they hold up and they last so I really like these whenever I can find I've been looking for some and I haven't been able to find them so these are the cute these are the designs I got they're so cute so whenever I see some fun cute designs and usually have them during special holidays like St. Patrick's Day uh, Valentine's Day um, those type of holidays 
they'll have some and you, I always love to pick those up so they don't have there's no holiday going on right now so they didn't have any but they haven't had any for a while but then they got those so oh here's one more that I got cute 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 love those and then I also got these uh, moisturizing socks after you put on your different foot lotions and stuff especially at night you can put these on these are very, very lightweight. I know some people get these and they think, oh, I can't wear those in the summer because they're too, they're too heavy. These are super, super lightweight. I'm going to take this out. You can see this is hardly anything to it. And that's why I got it because I have some, but they're like really thick and I can't wear them in the summer. So um, I decided that I would just pick these up for the, for the summertime. Okay, so I also picked up some I always pick up dental stuff there because I love it. These just kind of you can clean between your teeth. Great for lunch time to take you know take to work and have at your desk because they good at cleaning between your teeth. And I picked up they had these Elf um, brow and lash uh, gel ap applicator things. I've used these before and I really love them, but there's not very much product in here and they go really, really fast. So I'll go through one in like probably less than a month or like a month. So I picked up two of these because I really like them. There's one half is for your uh, eyelashes and the other half is for your eyebrows. So then I picked up a couple of lip glosses. I got this, but it's Hydra Gray Quick Root Touch Up. I, in between when I need to uh, dye my hair, I will touch up my grays with that. No problem. And then I was sitting in line um, at Dollar Tree behind this lady, and she was getting this really cute pillowcase, and it was a silk pillowcase, and it was a zebra print, and it was so cute, and I started to go back and get one, but I was in a hurry, so I didn't. But then the next day when I went, to Dollar Tree because I've been to Dollar Tree all this weekend Friday Saturday um, I decided to see if I could find it and this is the only one I could find um, this red one it's a silk one but it was the only silk one that they had they had some other ones that weren't silk that were different designs but I have to keep looking for the zebra print one though because the one she had was definitely silk and it was zebra print and so I just got two of those and then, um, since I was back there, I decided to look and see what else they had for, you know, your bed and all that kind of stuff. So, I found these mattress covers, just to protect your mattress. And I have a, a futon in my guest bedroom that I I bought it and I never took the plastic off because I was afraid cause that it would be ruined because it's, it's white, like a cream. And... Uh, I slept on it one time and I, it was so uncomfortable and so annoying to hear the this part right here rattling all night and I was like oh no one of my guests hate this thing so I decided to get this mattress cover in hopes that it would be a lot better than just the plastic that came with the futon so anyway having said that uh, I decided to get one for my bed as well so they had them in all sizes they had them in twin queen and I think I saw full, but I don't know about the king. But I did see twin, full, and king. So you might want to check those out if you need that. And then, uh, da, 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 I think that's, that's about it. Except for, this is the last thing. This is a, a chopping mat. So you can chop vegetables or even chicken or whatever you want on these. And they're probably not going to last like forever or anything like a chopping block even the chopping block doesn't last that long because once it gets too many chops in it it just kind of starts to degrade and you just need to replace it so I used to buy a disposable one that I forgot who made it glad or somebody but they quit making those and I love those things because I could chop chicken on those and then throw it away immediately because they were disposable so I think I would like this better I just hate washing chopping boards and trying to store them and do all this stuff. I just feel like it's not that sanitary. So I'm glad I found these. I, oh gosh, who, I want to say it was Inspirational Nails did a video and I'm going to link it, link it below because it was um, a very enlightening video. 
she was basically showcasing this in place of the uber chic uh nail mat so i don't know if you've seen those on youtube uber chic recently came out with um a mat and i've got stuff all on mine so <laughs> i cannot show it to you right now but they came out with an uber chic mat and uh, it's $14.99 plus shipping, which is like $5. So it's about 20 bucks. And that may be a little bit expensive for some people. So she was giving you options that you could get inexpensively uh, that would be do the same thing for you. So this is one of the options that she had. So this is just two for a dollar. You get two in here, so it's just a dollar. And you can basically put your... Uh, nail polish down and stamp over it and make your decals and test your colors and do everything it's not quite as big but it's pretty big um it doesn't it's 11 by 14 so the size of a legal sheet of paper it looks a little bit bigger than that no executive sheet of paper so the size of executive sheet of paper or uh what do they call it i can't remember what they call it but it's bigger than legal that's the size this is and um you can use that in places she gave another option that you could buy at walmart i think and it was basically made out of the same material as the uber chic mat and it was like ten dollars and something and uh it just doesn't have the nails and everything um on there but i think it was purpose for something else but it's the same material so I'll link that video below so you can check that out if you want to some options for uh, alternate options for buying the uber chic mat although I do love the uber chic mat it is awesome so if you can afford it <laughs> I definitely say get it because it's got the nails already there that you can kind of see what you're doing and all that kind of stuff so that is all I have for you today let me know in the comments box if you have any of this stuff or if you're planning on looking for it I would love to know and let me know if you have a Dollar Tree haul I love to watch them so I'll talk to you later